It's callbacks! I overnighted some tap shoes. Overnighted some tap shoes for my tap class this morning. And I know you're probably thinking, a tap class? A dance class? Good luck! Good luck to me. Listen, we have to start somewhere. I'll give you the full story of how I ended up attending this early morning tap class when I get back. I am so glad that these tap shoes came in time because if not, my friend was just like, oh, just bring sneakers to the first tap class. And obviously totally doable, but just could you imagine? All I can picture is like that squeaky sneaker sound. <laughs> Right, let's look at these new babies together. They're the brand Theatri Theatricals Footwear. I got these from Amazon and oh my, they're so cute. These are my first pair of adult tap shoes. I used to tap when I was younger, but I mean, it's been a long, long time. I think the last time that I tapped was when I was probably 10 years old and was in the show A Christmas Carol and I had to do that tap number. The stacking up the set. Oh, let me show you. I might be getting ahead of myself. I don't know if this is gonna damage my floor. Let me try really, really, really quickly, just briefly. I just gotta do a little full lap just to see if I still have the full lap. Oh! Oh my gosh. I can tell that I'm getting so excited just from hearing the little sound on the ground. <laughs> ah! It was like stacking up my silver and my bits of gold. Remember the choreo. Ah! <laughs> this morning is going to be interesting. I received the callback list around 11.30 last night and I only read the list and my name and the character that I called back for but I didn't read anything else. There in fact is a folder with a lot, a lot of material. I didn't see how much, but it seems that I have about eight scenes or so and a handful of songs and most of the song, it's not just like a little cut of it. So there's quite a lot of information that I need to either learn or brush up on today when I get back. I also am required to attend the dance call at the beginning of the callbacks. So I, unfortunately, as I suspected, will be having to dance today. As I'm having this conversation about telling you how much I am resistant to the dance call, it reminds me that I'm doing the correct thing by going to this tap class this morning. I get pretty nervous when it comes to the dance call and the dance portion, because as I've mentioned before, I feel as though I'm a singer, actor, and then dancer last. Not that I can't dance or can't be a strong mover, which is what I say, I am a strong mover, but I am tired of feeling this way and not feeling absolutely confident. I love when I can really feel strong in my stuff. And I feel like I'm lacking that confidence because I don't go to dance class. If I go to dance classes regularly, you have that motion, that movement, you're used to it. You're like, oh, we just gotta dance a little bit. I have been harassing every single friend I have in the theater community saying, if you know of a class, please let me know. If you go to a class, please take me with you. I am dying to go into any musical theater, jazz, tap, ballet. Like you let me know if you're going to a lesson and call me. One of my friends from Legally Blonde, just yesterday she was like, I'm going to the tap class tomorrow, beginner tap class. Do you want to come with me? And I'm like, I mean, this is what I've been asking for this entire time, someone to go with to the class and like, why not now? I have some tap shoes and I am going, I am putting myself out there this morning and I am, feeling I'm more worried about this dance class than I am the dance call tonight. And not only am I going to a dance class, specifically a tap, which I feel like tap, I'm always like. The dance class will be at a well-known studio. It is the Millennium Dance Complex. It has those red walls. You've probably seen clips of it on Instagram. And I'm just a little nervy because I'm sure that there are some iconic dancers that are gonna be there today, but probably not in my beginner's dance class. So I don't think that I need to worry about trying to keep up. Maybe that's my biggest worry, that I'm just worried that I won't be able to keep up. And the beginner is not beginner enough for me. Man, I am beginner, beginner, please. From the top, please, and slowly. I have not tapped in ages. Please pray for me. Ooh, I am nervous. What are we really nervous about? Because we have to learn. 
So it's okay to not know. We are going to a class to learn. But what if there are people that are super, super, duper good? That has nothing to do with you. Gotcha. <laughs> I'm realizing even if I do absolutely terrible and I even fall, like maybe that's probably like the worst. You're dancing so hard that you slip and you fall. I will just get back up and it will be fine. I'm good enough, I am safe, I am fine, and I'm gonna be okay. I mean, I'm finally going to a tap class. The earth is healing. <laughs> back from the dance class. I am showered, making myself some lunch before I start studying all these scenes that they sent over. So I hate to say it, I hate to say it, but I also love to say it. I had such, such a good time at the dance class. And I say I hate to say it because now after going today, I'm realizing that I have been missing out on some fun. I have been so afraid of tap and the technique around it and just how quick it is. And I was so fearful of it that I would avoid going to a tap class. It was so few like just hitting the ground at the same time. I was like, oh, this is scratching my brain and fueling me like how I feel when we're in musicals and we're all dancing together. Obviously that's what this is. So I don't know why I was so avoided to do it. Fear, obviously, fear, fear, fear. And that's okay because now I'm here and now I know. So I can't beat myself up for not knowing before. But wow, am I so thankful that I went. I left the dance class with that feeling that I get when I'm leaving rehearsal, just feeling inspired and creative. And also let me clarify, I was not even close to perfect. I don't even think I would use the word good as to what I did. I just did and I felt so good and I allowed myself to have fun and I'm getting a little emotional about it because my fear has kept me from enjoying this. And everyone was so nice, the teacher was so nice. My friend that invited me to the class texted me and she said, I'm so happy you came with me today. I hope you had fun. I know it's kind of hard for a beginner class, but you killed it. She's so sweet. And I've just been missing out on so much fun. Mm -hmm. I got these spicy garlic dill pickles from Ralph's. Delicious. It was like a dollar a bag, so I had to grab them. All right, it's time for review. Here is the Google Drive that they shared with us, labeled by character. Here I have mine, Natalie slash Ed. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is so much material. Oh my goodness. And the fact that I just got it today and it is 1.18 and I need to start getting ready at 2.30 and leave at 3.30 so I'm there on time. I literally only have an hour, so I really need to focus. It appears that I have eight scenes and two basically full songs. So allow me to practice. Okay, I just finished my hair and face. I can feel my stomach starting to flip and get excited and nervous. I'm so happy with how my makeup came out, but I'm gonna have to retouch it because I'm going to start off with a dance call. So I will be sweating. I do sweat in the face area, so I will probably have to touch up before we start singing and all that good stuff. Come on, come on. shoes or dance shoes but since my character is mainly in his sneakers I'm going to just show up and dance in these okay. all right three 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 magic number here we go it's time I'm three minutes behind It has been one hour since the dance call, so the sweat has gone down, but the hair is still a little curly. Touched up the makeup a little bit, and they are calling roll one by one, and I have a feeling my character might be the very last one, and that's okay. 
having a quick snack. We are two hours into callbacks and I still have not sung or read any scenes. They were singing all the characters and then they were like, wait, we wanna do some scenes so we can let some people go. Don't worry, Chad and Natalie, we will get to you. So I came outside and I'm having a bar. Two hours in, hope I get seen soon. Time check, it is eight o'clock at night and just got out. I got to do a scene. I got to go inside, see what the setup is. Wish me luck. I never had the intentions of updating you guys second by second, but there's, it's just so spacious here that I like, can step outside and chat with you. So this is quite nice. It is 8.50. Just read a bunch of scenes, went great, got some laughs. And now I wait to sing my songs. I haven't sung at all today and I am officially not warmed up. I probably, I'm gonna go warm up because I'm probably next. Like there's only like seven people left. All right, y'all. Yeah. It is 9.22 and I am leaving. I sang my songs, sang both of them, and I read some more and just those last few people here, so. And they said that the cast list will come out this Friday, so. As soon as I know something, I will tell you. So turn on lamp. Did that help at all? I'm completely backlit. It is 10.09 and I was finishing the rest of my bar on the way home. That was a total of four hours. I was there from five to 9.20. I'm hungry, I am tired, but I am just so super proud of myself for what I put out today. Put myself out there and went to a tap class. Like, I'm unstoppable. I'm so proud of the work that I did and for showing up for myself. And I just, I'm so happy. Whole day of doing so much of what I love and I'm exhausted, but like a great exhausted, you know? And as always, I wanna thank you so much for being here and for supporting me and encouraging me and just being with me through the craziness of this journey because it's, we never know what's gonna happen. We don't know, I have no idea. I went out there and did the best I could. We just have to wait for the list. So I will update you as soon as I know. I will see you guys so very soon.